Hey, what is good and what is going on? Jim Alfano with the Brook Team and EXP Realty here. Thanks for checking out this video. I hope you're doing fantastically today. And I gotta tell you what, I had so many cool listings that I picked out. I had an hour down and I struggled to get down to five with a bonus. Uh, so, and I'll show you what I mean by the bonus, but two of them in Norwalk, one Westport and Weston uh, Ridgefield and the bonus is in Wilton. So let's get to it. This first one literally, well, no, not literally, but it knocked my socks off when I checked it out. It's starting in Norwalk here. So please remember if you'd like to review some of the data, um, you could just pause uh, the screen, but let's scroll down here. 176 Ponus Avenue, Norwalk, Connecticut, four beds, four and a half baths, 5,400 square feet. Sometimes I will use round numbers, 1.6 acres. And it is such a beautiful home. Wait till you see this inside. I know you got a glimpse of the outside there above. Um, let's check it out. Now, I'm gonna start out by saying maybe the style isn't for everyone, but it, to me, is astonishingly beautiful. Let's go look. And I like color, right? So, you know, the red doors and this blue, look at this rich blue they used. That's fantastic. This, <laughs> I don't know, man, this room when I first saw it, I was so taken aback by it. Look at the goat. I mean, come on, what these, I, I want to meet these people because they're probably very cool people. And you got the little fireplace under the goat the red leather couches, uh, the TV is, is, is at a more, is it a reasonable, I just, this is awesome. This room is awesome. I love the modern touches. This office is so nice with the curved desk. Stone, I'm a huge stone guy as well. And just everything about this house is uh, stupendous in my opinion. Clo the closet, you know, it's just really nice. Look how I can, you know, I can imagine this, this, I can see the bags and stuff. So I'm gonna assume it's the lady of the house that's dressing in here and forgive me if it's the wrong assumption, but what a cool spot to have your clothing and all your stuff and get dressed and get ready for her. And this workout room is really, it's just, it's a great house. And this is so kooky. I absolutely love it. Uh, the the way they've connected it, the red accents, I, I don't know. I guess some people may object to it, but to me, it's very tasteful. It's rich, deep, contrasting colors. I think it's outrageously nice. It's outrageously nice. If I had the money, I'd buy this house. This is wonderful. Who wants to see it? And then you come down here, come <laughs> Oh, let's go. Oh, and then this is on top of everything else you've already seen. You have this outside. Are you kidding me? What a wonderful property. Seriously. I'm back at the beginning. So who wants to go see this? Let's go. And then, I, I, you know, this is another Norwalk one, modern. Also simply beautiful. It's, it's, uh, you know, just, I love the, the big windows and the windows on top and the lighting. This is another outrageously nice home. And it's a personal preference thing. Like someone may like this better than the other one. Um, and I, I think this is a phenomenal house as well. The other one, I mean, it's just such a, some of the design elements just, just speak to me a little bit more because they're a little bit more outlandish. But with this one, look at the proximity to the water here. So, I mean, this is just another awesomely beautiful home. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go tour this house today. Call me up, 203-408-1693. This Westport house also is insanely nice. All right, oh, I'm sorry, I didn't scroll down on the data on this one. Uh, 80 Cross Ridge Road, two beds, two and a half baths, 3,200 square feet. So for empty nesters and stuff, obviously with two bedrooms, they're not gonna fit a big family in here, but this is not, this is for entertaining and it's for 
a young couple or an older couple without kids, I, I would suppose. Great house. All right, let's 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 move on to Westport. So 78 Sylvan Road North, Westport, Connecticut, 4.3 mil. Uh, five beds, seven baths, plenty of room for that family. Uh, 8,000 square feet on a full acre. Definitely stepping into luxury there, as the description says. It's brand new construction, colonial. And let's see this, another outrageously gorgeous home. Yeah, it's just stupendously pretty. Very, very nice entranceway. I love the wood. The black touches against the light colored walls. I can't tell, it's not obviously a pure white, but it's a nice light color. And this is simple, but extraordinarily elegant at the same time. All obviously real high-end super touches in there. That's a fantastic fireplace. Great space. There's plenty of room for stretching out, entertaining. Beautiful touches here in, in the entrance to hang your hat and coats. Closets, which is very nice. Look at look at the amount to put all your outdoor gear and not have it completely exposed. And then the guests that come in just use the hooks real simple. Great wet bar. Oh, this bedroom is way too small. <laughs> That's nice and big, yep. Uh, and a beautiful bathroom, love the flooring. And the, the color and the theme is really uh, carried throughout the house. Just definitely pampered a luxury on that one. All right, so we are staying with the high-end luxury homes here for this next one. Actually, I think they're all high-end luxury, sorry. <laughs> but that's, I guess, what I was in the mood to look at today. So we have 29 Rogues Ridge in Weston, Connecticut. And we are six beds, six and a half baths, 6150 square feet and 4.7 acres. Exquisite custom estate, I agree, it is exquisite, built in 2016. Another absolutely fantastic home. Let us take a look. Now, the stonework at the bottom levels of this house combined with the natural stone on the property and they made that pool down there. You could, I don't know if there's koi fish in there. I don't see any fish, but just the, the water fall effect that's happening on that. The landscape is gorgeous and this house is is very beautiful, very big, very beautiful. I think these uh, railings are yeah, the modern railings. That you've seen them before, but they, I like them a lot. I'm glad they used them in here. I like these ceilings. It's a great dining room. This, this is a an outrageous kitchen. Super high end stove. I can see there an oven um, with the water filling, um, I don't know what they call it, the water spigot right there to fill the pots up. I, all right, I have something I don't like. I found I found something in all these homes I don't like. You ready? Those bar stools. Aside from that beautiful kitchen. <laughs> I think we could get rid of the bar stools. Anyway, um, yeah, I wonder if that's a warming tray in there or, or in, that's got to be a warming tray. And then uh, maybe the microwave built in. If you like to cook in the butler's pantry here. Oh, who's that? Oh, there's more than one. It looks like, uh, oh my God, I'm forgetting his name. The guy from Queens. Yeah, there's all kinds of musicians here. Beautiful picture. All right, I found another thing I don't like. I'm not in love with the wallpaper here. <laughs> Do love the elevator. Do love this central area here. That's, oh my, what a beautiful bedroom. It's a great house. This is huge. I mean, I, I can only imagine touring this in person. Would love to do that. And if you want to see, just give a call. Floor is here is great. The floor there is great. This this fireplace is outstanding. Look at this little second kitchen. This must be on the lower level. 
mean, this kitchen's better than most people have for their primary. It's phenomenal. Yeah, it's just a great property. Great house, great house. Let's go here next to Richfield. And I'm sorry, this is just another great house. I don't know. I I li obviously I like them all, but I I think I have my favorite, and this might be my second in line here. And again, the the aesthetics in this home, uh, the decorations, and like for me, this is super nice. I like that they did something different with the wood floor. I love the that light above that sink, um, the lights in the dining room. They did the, and the lighting is is a very important touch in a home. So they did a really nice job in that. I mean, that's super cool. I've never seen anything like it. And this is extraordinarily nice. Uh, great sitting room with the fireplace and those lights overhead. It just, it's just a great experience. And, and the way this living room flows to the outside is outstanding. simply outstanding and this middle room where you're kind of outside but yet still inside yeah they they're very very smart very well done what a what a wonderful office space this is I, I I don't know it's just a great house making this so this isn't a hallway they made this instead of like a normal boring closet they put these built-ins here uh, I'd like to, to Love to see this in person. And this is a whole separate section. Well, it's hard to get the perspective, the, um, the depth of this. But I think you go into those glass doors and the tub and the shower are all in just in the same space. What a, what a way to do that. And it's not a, a super, super huge bathroom, but it's super nice because you got the shower overhead, the bath, wow, this is very well done. Yeah, and the way this flows going up the stairs and the glass is another another way to do a nice modern touch to uh, a staircase. Oh, this guy's into sports. He's got a. I wonder whose boxing gloves those are. Larry Bird's jersey. Very cool. Yeah, super beautiful house. I mean, this this these houses I'm showing you guys today are just off the hook. <laughs> they just really are. Yeah, that outrageously beautiful. And here's the little bonus round. I'm not even gonna put this in the description. I'm just gonna kind of leave this as an Easter egg in the video, um, and I'm totally not gonna mention it in the description or in the email body. But this is, is so interesting. It's saying that it's got some damage in the house. It's offered at 1.3 million. It's brand new to the market, two days on, on active. Um, and they're saying it won't, it won't be financed, so you need cash. Wilton's a great, great town. It's newly built. So it's only 14 years old, 15. So it's interesting. I wonder what could have happened in there that they're warning people about walking into it. And you can only imagine the potential of this home because it's so hard to see with these photographs. Uh, it's, it's a st I, I'm a huge fan of stone. I said it already with that other house. And it doesn't have a dry. It's such an interesting property. I have no idea how much I like it or not. I am definitely extremely intrigued. Um, what are the specs on it? It's a one Rocky Brook Road in Wilton. It's four beds, four baths, 3,800 square feet, two acres, 1.3 mil. Bring your uh, suitcase of cash only. <laughs> I'm joking. Don't bring your suitcase of cash. Anyhow, hey, guys, look, reach out. Text call 203-408-1693. Again, 203-408-1693. You can reply to this email if you're getting an email, any way, shape, or form, any questions, comments, concerns, criticism, but um, just to go over real quick, I think this one's my favorite, and I think, where is it? I 
think this one's my second favorite if I'm gonna put it in that order and then then I don't know I think these two are kind of tied for third yeah that's where I'm at all right and this this enormous home in Weston sorry guys that's that's gonna be um, as magnificent as it is it's not in the, my top three all right be good talk soon Thank you.